everyone. For my final review video, my problem is number four on page 349, which says to represent the following products using black and red chips and to give the results. Um, part A is negative three times four, part B is two times negative four, and part C is negative two times negative one. In order to do these problems, we probably have to understand what they're asking for. Um, part A says to for three times to remove four black chips. Since we don't have any black chips, we're going to have to add them in. But in order to do that without changing the value of the equation, we'll have to add in zero pairs. Zero pairs are one black chip and one red chip because they cancel each other out so they equal zero, which means they won't change the value. So let's go ahead and do that. Add in zero pairs. We'll do four black chips three different times. So we're doing three groups of four. And since it's saying to remove four black chips three times, we can take away, there's four, there's four twice, and there's four three times, which leaves us with the answer of negative 12, because you see we have 12 red chips. For part B, the question says two times put in four red chips. Now, since we don't have red or black chips in this problem, we can just put in two groups of four. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Since it's red chips, we're going to do the red, and we end up with negative eight. On part C, we have negative two times negative one. And since a negative times a negative is um, equals to a positive, we know that negative two times negative one is the same as two times one. This one is similar to part A, where since we don't have red chips to remove, we have to add them in using zero pairs again. So we'll do, since it says two times remove one red chip, we're going to do two groups of one. But since there's zero pairs, we'll do a black one and a red one, and a black one, and a red one. And then it says two times remove one red chip. So you can remove that one, that's one, that's two, and you end up with positive two as your answer. Thanks for watching.